Bjorn Lomberg is a fellow at the Hoover Institution, author of False Alarm, How Climate Change Panic Costs Us Trillions, Hurts the Poor, and Fail to Fix the Planet, all of which is true. Bjorn Lomberg, we are grateful to have you on tonight. So it's a climate emergency. We've seen climate emergencies around the world. Um, how did they turn out? Well, look, first of all, this climate emergency, we've got to be real. Yes, the UN Climate Panel tells us global warming is real, but it's not an emergency. And telling people exactly. it's an emergency is a way to make us use money really, really badly. So look, for instance, on heat waves, as we've seen just now, yes, heat waves will get worse with global warming, but you also got to remember that when there are more heat waves, there are also fewer cold waves because the temperature goes up, because many more people die from cold. Actually, over the last 20 years at least, we've seen more people being saved than extra people dying. We need to hear both sides of that story if we're going to be in, well informed. It's not the end of the world. It is a problem. So if we're getting more heat waves, which is believable, it, whatever has caused them, of course, climate cycles are a feature of global climate and always have been, but we're getting more heat waves. You probably want air conditioning during a heat wave. And yet in this country, air conditioning is becoming unreliable because it's the biggest energy draw. And our utilities are saying we can't provide air conditioning in a heat wave. How, how is this logical? That, that's exactly the problem. Why do we get more? Uh, why do we get less people dying from climate disasters? Another statistic that most people haven't heard, we've actually seen a decline over the last 100 years of 99% in global climate catastrophes. Why? Because people get rich, because they get resilient. And that's exactly as you point out, because you can afford to run your air conditioner when it's really hot. And right. of course you can afford to run your heater when it's really cold, which actually kills about 10 times as many people. You need to be rich. And so we can't just say, look, you can't have more energy or energy is going to be incredibly costly. That is going to take away much of the stuff that actually delivers our wealth, the stuff we like about civilization. Yes, let's try to find smarter and less polluting energy sources, but let's not make it more expensive. Bjorn Lomberg, appreciate it. Thank you.